Yo, what is going on ladies and gentlemen, Revan here and welcome to another tutorial. In this video, I'm going to explain to you how to make a pattern in Adobe Illustrator. So without further ado, let's dive right into it. So over here, we have like the icons from the PlayStation. And as you can see now, if I would just move around, they're all just simple objects. Um, they're not grouped. So the first thing you need to do actually is group it. So you're going to select everything, press Command or Control G to group it, and now it is one single group. Well, now it's where the magic is going to happen, and it's actually pretty damn easy. You just click the group and drag it onto your swatches panel. And as you can see now, one pops up extra, and that is your pattern. If you double click on the one that just got added, no, I want that one. Here we go the pattern options will open so we're gonna give it a name so let's say play oh play station pattern and here we go well the the things around it which has like a lower opacity that's like a preview so if, if i would change the copies from uh let's say seven by seven it will get increased um all the other options you can just get check what you want uh, it's actually not that important just most of the times when you want to make a pattern this is what you want so just keep it the way it is and you're gonna click done at the top and now i can hear you think where the f did my pattern go well we're gonna fix that so we're just actually gonna hide the layer which we've just created the pattern on and we're gonna just get a shape so let's say a rectangle so we're gonna make an entire rectangle oh let's go to that layer and as you can see now, there is the pattern. So what just happened? Well, the pattern is actually just like a color. So if I would go to the, the color one, change the color to a red one, it's red. So the pattern is actually a color. Here you go. So that also means, if we just delete that one, if you want to make the pattern inside, let's say an ellipse, it's pretty damn simple. It's just like that. Well, if you want to make a change, uh, into your pattern, you will just double click on the swatch and here you go back to the pattern options. So let's say for example, we wanna change the color from the rectangle from a green to let's say, well, what are we gonna pick? Uh, a yellow. So we're gonna click okay. And as you can see now, it changes everywhere. So when we click done, inside the entire pattern, the rectangle changes from green to a yellow. So pretty damn easy. It's pretty hard to do when you don't know where to look so i hope you learned some today if you have any questions just pop them in the comment section below uh, and i will see you in the next video cheers hopefully you enjoyed the video if you did be sure to leave a like if not refresh it give it another chance got questions just ask them in the comment section below and i will see you in the next video